All right, I wanted to do a quick video for you guys on the perk package system in Modern Warfare 2. Uh, perk packages can be found under the custom loadout section. Uh, you have some custom loadouts here, so just click on any of your loadouts. And then off on the right hand side, you'll see the various perks that you have. Now, perks work different in Modern Warfare than they did, uh, I should say, in this iteration of Modern Warfare than in the past. You'll notice that you have two base perks. Now, these base perks unlock instantly. So when the match starts, you're instantly going to get the perks that you want. And it's pretty easy to just click on them. And um, actually, I think I had to edit them. Sorry, hit edit. There we go. Uh, it's very easy to just click on them and to see which ones are available. And you'll notice, just like most things in this game, a lot of stuff is locked behind your character level. So I'm character level 15. So I've unlocked uh, really nothing yet. You could see if I want to get overkill, that unlocks at 21. And you could just read the numbers in the descriptions here. These are just based off of your character level, okay? So you select two, and this is how you will always start the match. But after a set period of time, you'll unlock what they call your bonus perk. Now, the bonus perk will activate after about four minutes of gameplay. If you get a kill during this first four minutes, every kill will take off about 12 to 13 seconds. Somebody calculated it at 12.5. I've seen others say it's closer to 13, but after each kill, that timer will reduce by, let's just say 12 and a half seconds, okay? So if you're really smoking people very early on, you will unlock your bonus perk faster than everybody else. If you're not that great, or if uh, you're not having a great game, we'll just say, uh, you will still unlock it after about four minutes of gameplay. Now these perks also are unlocked by your character level. Again, I am character level 15, so you can see I don't have a ton of them locked. These are um, some pretty cool perks that I think will begin to change how you play the game. But where it really kicks in is the ultimate perk. The ultimate perk is activated automatically around the eight minute mark. However, again, as with the bonus perk, each kill that you get will reduce it by about 12 and a half seconds. So if you're starting off strong and getting a lot of kills very early on and playing very aggressive, there's a very good chance you're gonna receive your ultimate perk faster than anyone else. And ultimate perks really, in my opinion, are the elite perks in the game. Obviously it's in the name. Things like high alert, that pulse enemy vision, or ghost that makes you undetectable by most sensors. Overclock is the one that most of you will start with by default, unless you had some sort of collector's bonus edition. I don't think so, but um, this one will give you a really, really nice um, field upgrade charge rate reduction. And you'll instantly get a field upgrade at that time. So that's why I say the reality is you kind of want to be somewhat cognizant of how you're doing because you want to get value out of something like overclock. You want to use your field upgrade and knowing that when your next field, when you actually hit this level, you're instantly going to get another one. You don't want to have one already banked and then just basically, you know, does that make sense? You want to be mindful of how you're doing stuff. Now, some perks do stack. So you do have like a pool of them. So you won't necessarily lose it. But the reality is if you're playing aggressively, you're probably gonna wanna get your field upgrades out there as fast as you can. So that's how the upgrade system works with the perks. As with the other characters uh, in the game, they already have come up with preset packages for you, for things that you, know, you can try out all of the various um, abilities to see what you like. But if you, when, you're, when you're ready to make a custom package, just be cognizant of the fact that you're not gonna have everything ready yet. You're going to have to progress through uh, your character level just by playing to get up to a high enough level to unlock everything if you don't like what they have for you. But they give you enough to at least get you started. So I just wanted to go over that. And a lot of people have been, uh, a lot of my friends that I've been playing with have been asking me, you know, what's the difference between the base and the bonus? Is a bonus for every match? No. Is the ultimate, you know, so I, I think I've explained everything here well enough. But um, as I said in my previous video, which I, I will post a link to in the description below regarding uh, weapon gating, uh, this is definitely some significant gating on the custom perk package. So keep that in mind when you want to build your dream class. You may have to wait a while. 
that will wrap up today's video. Thank you all so much for watching. Take care of yourselves. And until next time, I will see you guys on the other side.